Not yet. Not yet? Oh, okay. So maybe I didn't, I didn't do it wrong. All <laughs> right. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, okay, so I need to, I think I need to go in here to do it. Share screen. And this is what I want to share. Can you it's see ready. this? It's coming. It's a coming. Here it is. We got it. Okay, you got it? Yes. Okay, so summer essentials in Atomy products. Okay, this is what I'm going to share with you tonight. Can you see it? Yes. Okay, summer essentials. Okay, what are summer essentials? Because we're into summer and, uh, you know, probably I'll do a winter, winter essentials when it's winter time, but uh, this is the summer. So I would like to share, you know, what what are the products are available in Atomy products. And this is the summer essential uh, special, okay? So I am going to cover the health and beauty. Uh, I'll start with the beauty and I, I will finish with the health. Okay, so beauty actually is the long, long uh, uh, introduction, long way to introduce because we have more the beauty products now than the health products, but uh, we do have a sufficient health product also. Okay, so here we go. Okay, so I like to um, share with you the difference between disease care providers and the healthcare provider. And I encourage you to become the healthcare provider because disease care providers are the doctors nowadays. They are disease oriented. So um, unless you have a diagnosis, uh, they don't care of you. They don't know how to care about you. So they need to give you the name or diagnosis in order to take care of you. <laughs> so they are the disease care providers. They will give you the name of diagnosis in order to bill your insurance or say, I can treat you. However, disease care provider, my opinion is you're too late because you have disease. So if you are under health care, that means you, your body is capable, still capable of healing. Okay. You still have time and you have still have chance. But if you have a disease, that means you're a little too late. They, they either need to cut some part of you or they need to give you intensive care. So that is a disease care, okay? So if you know how to take care of yourself, you become a healthcare provider, okay? To yourself and to your loved one, okay? So, th so there is a difference. I don't want to see you in the hospital. I want to see you in your house or in the party and we talk about the health. Okay. So that's your duty as a, as a atomian. atomian. <laughs> By the way, I, I, I think I shared this with you uh, already in 2016 when I visited Korea, I created the name at atomian because I felt like we are like a family and we're like a buddy. Okay. So I, thought about the name Atomian and uh, ever since I shared the name with uh, some of the people and they are start using the this name Atomian. Okay, so I don't want you to see you in the hospital. I intensive care. I want to see you when I my nutrition and my supplements can take care of you. So that's your identity healthcare provider. So so be um, be proud of yourself if you're taking good good uh, taking good care of yourself and your family. You are the healthcare provider. Okay, you don't need license. <laughs> so that's a good part of it. Okay, okay, and uh, I like to go over uh, the skincare, the beauty, because it is important. Because uh, especially in the summertime. And uh, the Atomy has a, a four uh, special technologies uh, in skincare. 
The one is the high purification technology. They, uh, they know how to take care of the dark color uh, and also um, the odorless uh, solution. Okay, so that is the high purification te technology. It's easy to remember if anybody asks you what's the special, so so special about the Anthony skin care, you can name one, two, three, four. One is high purification technology. It purifies uh, the herbal uh, ingredients to make it clear and also no odor. Because if they, let's say, if they want to put something like um, uh, the mushroom, okay? Uh, in Chinese, we call it, uh, uh, let's see, uh, uh, I forgot. I'll, I'll, I'll remember. Anyway, the mushroom, when you, when you brew the mushroom, it, 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 it smells awful, okay? So you cannot put that mushroom uh in this uh the skin solution okay so uh they need to use this special uh the patent technology to make it possible to, to make it uh available to our skincare product another one is a fresh herb extraction technology and uh you know uh do you like um the bottled uh, orange juice or a freshly uh, squeezed orange juice. <laughs> so, so I like freshly squeezed orange juice. Okay, it tastes much better. So, if you want to use uh, the fresh herb extraction technology into your uh, the beauty products, so they get it. They they have it. Okay, so they they uh, they harvest all those uh, fresh herbs leaves and they make the extraction and then they they use a high purification technology and they put right into your skincare product okay another one is a fermentation technology this fermentation technology is a very old technology your your uh the wine is a fermentation fermented you know all the uh uh, uh you know the uh, the uh, the eateries that uh, that need, needs to store for a long time has to be fermented, okay? And uh, this fermentation technology break down the particles of active ingredients from your uh, from the herbs or herbal ingredients. So it is very important that uh, the atomy has this uh, technology because. Um, if you're not able to break down the particles from the active ingredients, then just the putting whole herb doesn't doesn't do any good because uh, some of the herb has uh, it carries the toxins and you don't want to have a toxins in it. Okay, so another technology is a um, multiple capsulation technology, delivering technology. This is uh, increased absorption of the nutrients to. The deepest layer of the skin. In other words, this is the speed, the speed of how your how the the uh, uh, herbal ingredients can get into your skin. Okay, so uh, uh, in the past, you you actually you tap on your face to stimulate your face so that the active active ingredients can get into your skin. So with this multiple capsulation, uh, cap capsulization, uh, capsulation delivery technology, you don't have to tap on your face to put your active ingredient in ingredients into your face, into your skin. So we have this one, two, three, four special patent technologies that make Atomy skincare uh, special. Okay. Okay, so it's a summer, so I like to go over what causes the facial wrinkles. Okay, the facial wrinkles, you know, if you have a graceful uh, wrinkles, actually, probably you shouldn't care. Okay, but if you don't have graceless wrinkles, then probably you need to care because graceless wrinkles are coming from anger, worries, fear sorrow 
<laughs> okay. So from those emotions, negative emotions, you're making those negative wrinkles. But if you um, if you enjoy happiness, content, contentment, your wrink, wrinkles are actually graceful. So I like to uh, get old gracefully. Hopefully you are too. So the wrinkles that is graceful are graceful. I think that you like to keep it. You don't want to do a Botox shot to, uh, you know, make it straight to flat. I don't want you to do a uh, cosmetic surgery because graceful wrinkles are telling who you are. So as graceless, uh, but, uh, so we like to, uh, are responsible for our wrinkles. So if you read all those, uh, like a uh, forehead lines and front lines, uh, cross feet lines, lip lines, and smile lines. Uh, most of them are caused by the sun damage, some uh, sun exposure, and negative facial expression, and uh, sleeping positions, or insomnia, uh, ne negative facial expressions. Um, and uh, let's see, and uh, you know, smiling and laughing uh, wrinkles are pretty good, you know. Maybe you don't want to erase those wrinkles, okay? And uh, uh, and the smoking, drinking, uh, they are making, uh, you know, like uh, lip lines and uh, and also, you know, uh, some of the uh, regret lines. There are, are some regret lines around your lips. So um, I don't want to tell you that, and uh, but uh, it's around your lips. And uh, when I see my patients, I, I, I can see, oh, the patient has uh, regret. Okay, so you don't want to have many of those lines. <laughs> so there are, there are lines can tell you, you have a lot of regret. Okay, so you don't want to have those regret. Okay. So how to protect your skin from sun exposure. Okay, so we're going to go over some of the uh, atomy products and uh, those are my essentials and also um, my favorite uh, uh, product actually and uh, I, I love those products and uh, I, I, I think you also have your uh, uh, favorite uh, but uh, the following are my favorite. Okay, so this is the new and Marie Ample eye patches uh when i saw this and i thought well okay so i can just use two or three i can uh, cover some of my uh, wrinkles with the uh, you know a uh, graceless expression <laughs> you know some of the uh the uh, uh the lines in between my eyebrow you know because um you know i i should wear uh glasses but uh in my age, uh, I cannot wear, you know, nearsighted or uh, farsighted glasses. It's I am in between, so I don't wear anything when I when I uh, see my patients. So I try to, uh, you know, try to. I guess I try to adjust my focus. So I try. I start to create uh, wrinkles in between my eyes, and uh, and I think a lot when I treat my patients. So I I start to have a wrinkle. So I, when I um, saw this new product, I, I said, I am going to use it every day. And uh, I love this product. And uh, I'll show you some of my uh, experience with my patients and uh, using this eye patches. For the tired skin in summer, this is the, uh, one of my favorite um, I think it used to call uh, um, the uh, different name for this. Um, I forgot the name. It, it has a more products. Um, they, they discontinued, but uh, some of the ingredients are similar in this product. Um, and uh, the main uh, ingredients are to uh, hydrate your skin and moisturizing your skin and the brightening. And uh, so, this product, 
um, you can place on your face when you're under the sun and uh, exposed to hot uh, temperature, hot uh, the climate, and uh, it's very cooling. Okay, so and uh, this uh, um, oh, actually, okay. Let me see if I can go lower. Oh, sorry. Okay, so uh, high temperature and high humidity. High humidity not necessarily can moisturize your skin because if your skin is not able to absorb the uh, humidity or uh, the moist, that means you are still dry, okay? Yeah, so uh, excessive sweating, okay? So it's better than uh, during the winter time, but the excessive sweating, that doesn't mean that it can moisturize your skin. Okay, and uh, using air conditioner and uh, and the fan uh, right uh, above your bed, your then that is a very bad actually. Okay, and uh, any of you has a uh, the fan uh, above your bed, and make sure you turn off that fan before you fall into sleep. Okay, if you turn on that fan, I guarantee that you wake up with a body ache. I guarantee it. Okay. So if you wake up with the, oh, I feel like I had a, <laughs> you know, like I exercised overnight or something, you, you have, you have aches and pain and, uh, you know, you have a sore muscles. Uh, probably you, you didn't, you forgot to turn off the, uh, the fan above your, over, on your ceiling, above your bed. So make sure you turn that off because your your body your skin cannot protect yourself uh while you're sleeping the chi the energy enters deeper layer of your body and uh, you don't have the protection on the surface while you're sleeping that's why you have to wear the blanket right okay if you have the blanket you don't fall into sleep <laughs> you have to have a blanket even if it's a very thin layer at night, you have to have the blanket because you don't have the uh, surface protection at night. Uh, it's not just according to Chinese medicine, it's according to the, uh, the fact you don't have the protection at night while you're falling to sleep because your surface energy is protecting your organs uh, while you're sleeping, not your skin, not on the surface. So you have to have the uh, blanket uh, and, and also you have to cover your belly because that's your stove. If your stove is cold, that means you're not going to digest anything overnight. Okay. So make sure you cover your belly while you're sleeping. Okay. So that's very important. Uh, natural plant based ingredients. Okay. So this is what I like the birch tree sap. Okay. I'm sorry to uh, to steal the sap from the birch tree, <laughs> but they are the givers in the uh, in the environment. The, um, all the trees, the plants are the givers. Okay, and uh, you know, um, hopefully uh, they nourish our skin and our health to keep us healthy. The the birch. Uh, the tree sap, they're sacrificing their sap to give us, uh, we, we should give a, uh, we should give a prayer or uh, give a thanks when we use this because it contains bird tree sap, okay? And the sea berry fruit uh, extract, and uh, they are really into moisturizing and the healing of our skin. So you can read all those small letter, uh, letters and, uh, you know, they keep you, uh, moisturized, more moisturizing and also, um, and, uh, and, uh, improve your wrinkles. Okay. And, uh, like I said, this, uh, um, this uh, toner is a very special. It's not just a toner. This is a toner plus a serum. And uh, it used uh, micro encapsulated vitamin E and cellulose and the uh, mineral. And uh, 
So this also used uh, the capitalization technology. And so, so make sure uh, that this, uh, the toner and serum can get into your skin fast. Okay, the speed. Okay, because your skin is a burning. So, uh, so this technology, this product will make your skin cool very fast. Okay. Um, and, uh, this, uh, the, um, this product also has a brightening technology, the brightening using a vitamin B12 and, uh, and uh, brightening technology. And so, you know, if you're under the sun, sometimes you just burn and sometimes you get a little suntan, but uh, something is okay. But uh, if you get, uh, you know, like a sunspot, which you don't want to, because you don't have the, uh, you don't have the even uh, color. And, uh, you know, I don't like an even color on my face. I like to have uh, even color. <laughs> and so this will help you, uh, you know, uh, your uneven color of your skin. And other than that, I like the scent, you know, uh, the scent of uh, some of the Atomy products, actually they don't advertise as uh, the, uh, uh, the aroma uh, essential oil therapy, but uh, it already has a special, the natural scent in some of the Atomia products. So make sure you smell some of the uh, the healthcare products before you use it. You put on your face or on your skin, uh, on your palm, and you smell before you apply to it. They will help your stress and uh, they will help your uh, anxiety. And so you, you use the benefit of the uh, natural scent. That's aroma. Uh, you know, uh, some of the, uh, the essential oil, uh, you know, can help, can the benefits, it's aromatherapy. It can calm your uh, anxiety, depression, and uh, some uh, the bad mood. Okay. So, like I said, this has a little fruity green floral scent. And, uh, you know, um, so it will give you uh, a, li uh, a little lift and also it, you can calm your mood at the same time. Uh, so whenever you use anything, you give things because you are able to afford this product. And also uh, your, you know, the nature, the, um, is, a, is sacrificed for you, uh, to make you feel better. And so you should be thankful whenever you use this, those natural products. And, uh, and maybe you can say a prayer or you can, you know, um, uh, you can enjoy the moment of having um, this product. Okay. Okay. So the next product is uh, Derma Real Sika. Uh, in Chinese, we call it Ji uh, Xie Tao. Uh, when I was studying uh, TCM dermatology, uh, we used uh, this ingredient uh, to uh, treat various uh, skin issues. And uh, by the way, I am the only uh, certified uh, TCM dermatologist in whole Georgia. <laughs> I never. I, ad I never advertised uh, uh, nowhere actually in my in my uh, you know uh, the SMS SNS or uh, even not even uh, in my uh, business card or uh, my um, uh, my um, web page. I, I, I actually I didn't say anything, but anyway, uh, that's not important. But um, What's important is, uh, you know, I love uh, some of the natural ingredients they use in uh, Atomy, the skincare product, uh, uh, because I wanted to use some of the ingredients. Uh, but uh, I didn't know, actually, I didn't know how to use it. I, I how to make up 
you know, uh, how, how to uh, put uh, some of the active ingredients into the uh, um, the external uh, the, the um, herbal uh, remedy. Okay, actually, I could use in my herbal uh, decoctions, but uh, it's it's not easy to use in some of the uh, um, uh, the skincare products. But uh, you know, thanks to uh, Ashmi, uh, you know they created um, the uh, uh, the, uh, the some of the very important technologies, and they were able to uh, put you know uh, the uh, plenty of active ingredients in their product. So I am going to play this. Uh, hopefully, we have enough time because I thought this is pretty good. You know. Uh, okay, so let me play this. Hopefully, this plays well. Oh, yo, no, this is not the one that I wanted to play. Okay. Well, anyway, so, um, oh, all right. Okay. Actually, this, uh, this, uh, the video that I, I wanted to share with you is actually is from Atomy company directly. Um, uh, you know, the, uh, the story goes, um, this, uh, the, uh, one of the uh, largest island, uh, in South Africa, uh, you know, they have this herb and, uh, the king of the uh, the forest, the, the lions, won the uh, the competition with the, all the uh, fishes uh, animals, and uh, he was uh, injured also, and uh, he actually robbed on his his robbed his uh, wound on this uh, the sea coupling, and uh, he got cured. <laughs> he, he was he healed, so that's the uh, story. And uh, this uh, sea coupling actually has a medicinal uh, property. Actually, uh, they labeled uh, classified as a, a medicine, but uh, since it's a plant, uh, they actually used uh, in the healthcare uh, uh, line and products. And uh, we have, uh, that's why they call it a dermatology plus uh, cosmetic. Okay, so this is, uh, you can call it semi-medicine, okay, because the next, I'm going to share a lot of pictures of my patients. Um, actually, I didn't show uh, nobody's face, uh, only the skin. So I guess I could, you could actually share with your partners. And... Uh, I haven't posted uh, to my um, Instagram or anywhere. <laughs> I just opened one, and uh, but uh, I am uh, probably I am going going to post it. Um, okay. No, no, no. I am going to. No. Okay. So I think, okay, here. Okay. So I think I showed this uh, last lecture or presentation and that the photo was not really clear. And uh, this was uh, one of my patients and uh, she came with the skin issues. She was referred by one of uh, other patients and uh, uh, and she came and uh, she suddenly had this uh, skin issue. She called it uh, acne. It looks like acne, but uh, you know, it was so uh, sudden. Uh, so it was uh, some sort of uh, toxic in her body. Um, so, uh, you know, it, it, it sees uh, some rashes and also uh, popules and uh, there was a some itching, uh, very dry, and uh, it just uh, looked very uh, serious. And uh, she went to see her esthetician, 
and uh, right after my visit and uh, her institution told her to see a dermatologist. Actually, a dermatology appointment was uh, three days later and she said um, her skin got better in two days, okay? And uh, this, uh, the after picture is af actually after almost 45 days later and uh, you can compare the uh, the before and after skin. So her skin is just amazing and uh, there is no dryness um and uh you know it radiate uh, radiates and uh, and she's very satisfied with the uh, result and uh, this is uh, one of the uh, the, uh, the products that I used uh, um, and um I only uh, gave her the actually um um the uh the toner. I didn't even, I didn't even, uh, uh gave her the ampoule or, uh, the cream and uh, she only used the toner and uh, she got better. And the later, actually, later I gave her the rest of the, uh, the formula, um, the product, but, um, she already got better after two days. Okay. So this is an, and, uh, another, Picture is uh, just a few days ago. Uh, this gentleman came, and she he came for other issues. But uh, when I saw his face, and I thought uh, she was he was wearing uh, the glasses, and uh, I took off his glasses, and I saw uh, he has this uh, contact dermatitis from his glasses because you know it was sweating and the hot, and he keep uh, you know, lifting his eyeglasses. So it created a rash, and uh, so um, so I decided to use a marine ample eye patch and also a Derma Real Seca, um, and uh, in 45 minutes, um, it calmed his skin very well. Okay, so this is another picture with the you know the same day actually, and uh, this uh, lady came uh, actually. She came for other issues, but uh, when I look at her face, um, uh, she has uh, this uh, rosacea. Um, the uh, how to identify the rosacea? You see when you see some of the uh, uh, the blood vessels. Uh, those, you know, um, um, you know, thin, tiny blood vessels that means uh, the patient has a rosacea and it's just it, it's not just the rash or uh the popules uh, it, it has to have uh, some blood vessels you can see through so and so i use uh, the marine ample eye patch and the uh, derma real Sika 45 minutes and uh, you can see uh the redness uh, is uh, has disappeared and um, and improved, and also the darkness has improved also around the team. Okay. Okay. So this is a serious. <laughs> so uh, this patient got burned uh, a week ago uh, from the motorcycle muffler, and. Um, you know, are you there to use this toner? <laughs> so can you trust when they say what it does? You know, toner, this, uh, this uh, derma real Sika can calm the uh, uh, sensitive skin, uh, can help the burns. So can, you know, did you trust? Did you believe that uh, you can really, it can really do that? <laughs> so when I read the ingredients, I, I know the ingredients. I, I trusted the ingredients. And so I said, well, okay, so I need to cool um, the wound uh, from the burn. And so I did it. Yeah. So uh, the patient act actually uh, stated that um, it was amazed that uh, it's not a burning or sting stinging. Actually, it was a calming experience with the uh, batoni. Okay, so 
So uh, if you have a minor burn, this is a secondary burn actually. If you have a sunburn, you feel very hot. You don't have anything. If you have the corner, the uh, derma real seca corner, you can apply it. Okay. Okay. So uh, uh, did you know we have uh, three types of uh, spray uh, you can use during the winter, uh, the summertime. Of course, you can use during the winter time also, but uh, uh, I picked those three because uh, those are so special. And, uh, you know, uh, probably you like to have those, uh, you know, in your bag for, for ladies and uh, for men, I don't know, you know it's, uh, maybe you can put in uh, somewhere like uh, the ice box <laughs> in your car. It's not a good idea that uh, put you in your the hot uh, vehicles. However, um, so the first one is a cream mist. This is a uh, brand new uh, uh, in uh, in Atomy in US. So this cream mist, I I used some of the uh, uh, keywords. Okay, so you know what is you you should know what is what. You know what is beauty water. What is, what is the rose water. And what is cream water, you know, like which one is what, you know. The cream mist, uh, it helps, uh, you know, uh, flushes and the cracks easily due to menopause. So if you can remember that, right? So if anybody has a hot flash, okay? And uh, I feel hot all the time. I feel hot day and night, you know, and I don't know what to do. Okay, maybe you can uh, share the cream mist, okay? For those who are going through menopause, by the way, menopause is not a disease, it's just a symptom, okay? So um, when you say menopause, uh, they like to use some hormone therapy and this and that, um, but uh, you can actually prevent uh, from using those, the hormone, uh, you know, put into your body. Uh, because if you use one hormone, you have- Get it. So, thank you. Okay, so uh, the cream mist, the new product, can help a menopause patients or clients. And uh, when they uh, um, uh, complain of uh, hot flashes with uh, dry skin cracks and so on. Okay, three second beauty water. Um, you can say this is also aroma therapy uh, for the stress and anxiety. So that means after you take shower, they recommend that you spray on it, uh, spray on your face or some part of your body. Why three, sec three uh, seconds? Because the absorb absorption rate, the speed is that fast. Okay, the speed. Everything is about the speed. Okay, you don't want to feel dry and uh, you don't feel, you don't want to feel hot, humid. You can spray three, three seconds beauty water um, that, uh, that refreshes your mood. Okay, uh, add to me a rose rain mist, rose rain, rose uh, water, as you all know. So rose water can calm your anxiety and the depression. Okay, you feel your love. Okay, so when you spray um, on you, you should feel your love. Okay, you spray on somebody that you love, who, whom you love. Okay, so that's the rose and cools your skin in summertime. Okay, this all can also can be used, you know, when you have a minor burns. All this uh, mist, water, you know, uh, you can use the uh the hot skin hot when you are hot and um and also if you want to um make it even better maybe you can keep in the refrigerator for a while and then spray it on it okay you can also help on your uh your friends okay we cannot uh so without the uh, sunscreen in summertime, we have uh, actually three different types of sunscreen 
Uh, they are all SPF 50 plus, and uh, also they are PA plus 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 four pluses. That means they can protect from UVA and UVB. Okay, UVA, UVA can go deeper to your skin dermis layer. That means UVA can make you more wrinkles and make you more old looking. So you want to protect yourself from UV, UVA. UVB is a little shorter. They can actually burn your skin. Okay, so when you have the sunburn, you had the UV, UVB. And UVC is not really reachable to us. They're in somewhere in the ozone layer and uh, they're not really you know, into us, but, uh, you know, as you know, ozone layer is start to, uh, you know, thinner or, you know, broken. So who knows, we could have all kinds of other type of uh, UV rays, uh, radiation, but uh, so far, the, uh, the UVA, UVB, that means uh, the SPF 50 plus and the PA four pluses can protect from UV, UVA and UVB. Okay, atomy sunstick whitening. I put whitening because it does whitening and the other actually um, the uh, sunscreen does some whitening, but uh, this uh, the sunstick is especially mentioned uh, the uh, whitening and the sunstick um, I think it's easy to care and uh, and uh, it, it's almost like a deodorant and but uh, you can use on the uh, the makeup um, over the makeup okay and uh, it, it's non-sticky it, it's a stick but it's non-stick <laughs> it's non-sticky <laughs> okay so it's it's a very dry, uh, it's not dry it's 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 uh, uh it's not uh, oily or it's not sticky and some of the sun uh screen are sticky i don't like the feeling i feel very thick on my skin so i don't like those uh textures but um, this is a very uh, uh light and uh and uh, you can use uh, it's a very convenient, uh, you know, when you when you go out, uh, when you have uh, activities under the sun. And uh, the next one is actually is even better, and I think it's even better. I, I like it uh, more than uh, this one, and uh, that doesn't mean that this is uh, it's, it's, this is not a good product. But uh, the next one is ethnic dermal calming sunstick okay so this one is uh, under derma uh, cosmetic line uh, and uh, this one also has the spf uh, 5 plus and the pa 4f 4 pluses and uh, this one it has actually has a some feeling uh, uh, the uh, um, power some healing um, uh, element because uh, there are two um, the herbal uh, ingredients um, that could actually help uh, the burn to heal and so if you this product versus the other one I think this is already when you have some sun damage or sunburn you can put this on but before you have the sunburn you can use the previous one okay the previous one this one you can before you have the sunburn you can use this and uh if you already had the sunburn you can use this one um this is a phyto calming complex there are two herbs and uh, you can uh, these uh, those two herbs one of them is actually aloe as you know aloe can cool the the, uh, the heat and uh, the other one um is um uh, I forgot the name. Uh, it's anyway, yeah. Um, so the, uh, the there are two herbal ingredients. They can help the burn, and uh, and uh, believe it or not, the, this can also help the acne. So if anybody has acne and they 
They don't like the uh, some of the uh, sunscreen pictures and sticky and uh, you know they some you can feel a little itching after you apply those uh, the sticky sunscreens uh, probably uh, they like to you try this uh, those who um, have acne and the sun damage skin okay Okay, so the next is the health part. We, uh, I already finished the beauty part of uh, the atomy, uh, the summer essentials. And this is my uh, atomy health essentials. The first one is a uh, hemoheme. And, uh, you know, uh, I have to go over the hemoheme <laughs> because this is the number one atomy product. And uh, this is the uh, the mecca of uh, atomy, uh, the product. The hemoheme uh, is the, as you all know, we don't have uh, a hemoher. And actually, one of my patients asked me if there is a hemoher <laughs> because it's a hemoheme. So I told her we don't have hemoher. You know, this is a hemoheme covers women, men, or women. So uh, this, you know, if you're under the sun for too long, make sure you drink plenty of water. And uh, and uh, this is slightly sweet. So this really helps uh, the sun stroke. You know, the sun stroke. The sun stroke is, can be uh, life draining. People can die from the sun stroke. Okay, it's very, very, very serious. I've seen the son, the patient with the son stroke, and uh, he was uh, under coma, and uh, he was in ICU. And boy, I thought, wow, son stroke can do that. And uh, actually, he um, he recovered after uh, this special acupuncture, uh, scalp acupuncture, uh, back in China. And um, the uh, son stroke can be very uh, serious and life threatening. So if you're under the sun for too long, make sure you take this hemohim. You can, you can prevent the sunstroke, okay? And make sure you drink lots of water. And I put this uh, hong chan dan. Uh, dan, dan. Uh, hong chan dan is the chi tonic in Chinese medicine and the hemohim ingredients are blood fun. So if I want to tonify, nourish the both uh, the uh, the chi and the blood, I would use both together, okay? And the, the next one is a pomegranate. I put uh, pomegranate because, uh, and, and also uh, the hung sang dan here because uh, those are, uh, you know, those three products are abstract, you know? The hemohim is extract of uh, uh, the herbal ingredient, and hong sam dan is the extract of uh, the red ginseng, and the pomegranate is also extract. So when I introduce the pomegranate, um, this uh, the the atomy product to one of my patients, and she said, "Oh, I don't have to take this because you know I can just take uh, you know buy the pomegranate." And I say, well, how many can you take? <laughs> if you take one of this, it covers at least 10 of them, <laughs> 10 of your pomegranate. So which one you want to take? You know, can you take 10 pomegranate? If you cannot take 10, then why don't you take just one of this and drink lots of water? Okay? Yeah. So, uh, you know, people who don't know this product, they like to argue with you. I don't have to do this. I like the natural. I like to, you know, just the fresh ones. Okay, that's good. But, um, you know, some of the active ingredients in this product is 26 times more than, you know, uh, this eight ounce of water, eight, eight ounce of water of the pomegranate beauty. Okay, so two of pomegranate beauty can cover more than 26 times more than eight ounces of fresh sweet uh, pomegranate juice. Okay, so um, so you, you don't have to argue with uh, those 
people who like to argue with you, you just tell them this is a fact. That's all you need to do. You don't have to argue. This is a fact. And also, uh, the, uh, the Hong San Dan also, if there's a thing, uh, uh, the saponian level is, uh, uh, the ginsenocyte is 20, 20 milligrams. This probably covers like a 10 roots of, uh, your red, uh, red ginseng. Okay. So if you just chew on this, uh, 10 roots, if you just uh, take one, can cover, uh, the 10 roots. Okay, so let's see if I have anything left. Okay, vitamin C. <laughs> I prepared this only for Uncle Mike. He uh, he asked me several times, uh, you know, what's the red color for? Or what's the, uh, the yellow color for? Oh, okay, so I'll just go over it once again. So this came from five element, element theory in Chinese medicine. It is absolutely amazing uh, theory or understanding from our ancestors. You know, the language and uh, you know, uh, the language was um, limited and uh, a lot of people were uh, illiterate and so they don't know when you write a character, they didn't understand what you're saying, okay? But they can see the colors. <laughs> they can smell and they can taste. But when you write a letter, they could understand, okay? So, you know, what you need to do is just to show the colors. The color, the red colors enters your, enters your heart in small intestine. This is scientifically proven believe it or not. And uh, the green color enters the liver and gallbladder, and the yellow color er enters the spleen and the stomach. White color enters the lungs and large intestine, and the black color enters the kidney and the urinary bladder. And there are taste also, the sour taste with the uh, green and bitter taste with the uh, red color, sweet with the yellow, pungent with the white and the salty color with the black and there are some emotions uh you know linked to uh, those colors anger the green think about the anger the green what character can you name one what character in the movie Can anybody name one? The Grinch. Character? The Grinch. <laughs> the Green. Incredible Shrek. Hulk. Incredible oh, Hulk. Hulk. <laughs> He's <Yep>. green. <laughs> yep. What in the world, David? Pain painted him with the green color. He's angry. <laughs> ah. You'll never forget this. Green Hulk. He's angry. <laughs> okay. So joy, you know, when you when you give uh, love. When you pass, you, when you share, uh, when you show your love, you know, what color of uh, uh, rose do you, would, would you pick? You know, it's red because it symbolizes your heart. You, you're actually, you're giving your heart, you're sharing your heart, okay? So anyway, so uh, seven color, uh, the, uh, the color food, and uh, this was, uh, you know, later, much, much later, it, it, this color, uh, theory was, you know, introduced like a uh, first century, <laughs> not not the twenty twenties or twenty first century. <laughs> this color uh, knowledge was introduced way before the century, probably. Okay, um, but the color a uh, color food is important because it can protect our body from the uh, free radicals and also uh, from the cancers and so on, okay? So I put this um, here because it can also protect from the sun spots and sun damage of your skin. So you make sure you take extra vitamin C and uh, when you know uh, you're, you're going to be under the sun, 
And so make sure you take extra vitamin C with a lot of water. And uh, actually you can put on your skin also. And uh, I know some of the uh, partners, they already tried this on like a, a peeling gel or a peeling mask that they mix with a peeling mask that they put on the face. And uh, they, uh, they found amazing results afterwards. So uh, you can test before you share with your your clients, your partners, make sure you try on your face on your you try your first um, and before you share, that will give you uh, the um, uh, confidence and uh, and you will feel uh, feel good about yourself. Okay, that will give uh, you know lift your self esteem also because you give what you're trusting. Thank you very much. This is all for today. Thank you for listening. All right, thank you very much, Dr. Sway. Let's give him a hand. Whoa, that was great. I hope you all took a picture of that five element chart because it was tough. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna take a few questions, have a, a, a few question answer. Uh, there was one thing, Dr. Sue, that I uh, swayed, excuse me, that I wanted you to repeat, and that was about the wearing of the mask. Could you repeat that, please? Oh, uh, wearing a mask. Uh, the, uh, uh, peeling, uh, uh, the peeling mask. Oh, okay. That's what you were referring to a minute ago. You said something about yeah, yeah, the mask. Peeling mask, the peeling mask you can mix with the peeling, peeling mask. One of the nice things you can And, uh, and you can apply. See, uh, see if you like it and let us know if you like it. Okay. Yes. We have several people that have used different things, uh, including the color food vitamin C, uh, in their, uh, peel off mask. So yes, that's very good. If you have a question for Dr. Sway, uh, feel free, unmute, raise your hand. Mon, did you have your hand up or you're adjusting your screen? Adjust your screen. Okay. Any I've questions? Got, got a, yeah, I've got a question, uh, Uncle Mike. Yes. Uh, Dr. Sue, this is Stephen. Um, yes, and you. you you didn't mention this on this uh, presentation, but your last presentation, I have a, a friend of mine, like a brother that played professional ball with me, and he has a lung disease. And you mentioned something, one of our products that was good for the lungs. Can you please share that with, with us again? Yeah, sure. Uh, well, uh, first of all, thank you for remembering my past <laughs> lecture. Yes, sir. Presentation. Not yes, sir. how many people can remember, unless yes, you're sir. interested in it or you, you like to share with your loved ones. And yes, sir. Thank you for remembering. Um, so, uh, for the lungs, if you want to uh, help your lungs, you need to help your large intestine. Because Say that in, Chinese, in Chinese medicine, the lungs and the large intestines are connected. Okay. okay. So, okay. when you treat the lungs, you don't just treat the lungs. You, you like to treat your intestines, especially the large intestines. Yes, sir. So, make sure that person's bowel movements are good. If yes, he sir. has a constipation, make sure the constipation is relieved. If they have a diarrhea, make sure their diarrhea is better. So Good. my recommendation with the enemy product is um, our, uh, the uh, probiotics, of course, and the fine zines. The probiotics and what now? Fine zines. Fine zines. Okay. Yes. Yeah. How much do you need to take uh, with the probiotics? You smell your gas, and so if you still smell your gas, then you you increase your dosage. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and uh, after you eat, you feel uh, like uh, bloated. You take fine zyme. The bloating is still there. You take extra fine zyme. Yes, sir. You, feel, you don't feel bloated. You keep taking it. Drink lots of water. That's my. That's your. That's his dosage. Don't yes, ask me if that's my dosage. That's his okay. dosage. Okay. Okay. And, oh, and, and is that and is that it? It's because I thought you mentioned something else. And uh, to help the lungs, have the lungs are connected to your nose I'm and sorry. to your skin. Okay. 
So to diagnose your, uh, the uh, lungs, sometimes I look at their skin, whether it's a dry or cracked or wet. And uh, you examine, I examine the, uh, the, lung, the uh, skin, right? Okay. Yes, and sir. So if the person doesn't sweat much, then I would uh, tell the person to do some aerobic exercise to sweat out the toxins through the skin. The okay. sweat works. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, so however, you know, uh, nowadays it's very hot uh, outside and, uh, you know, the person can get sunstroke. You don't want to get sunstroke. So exactly. like I said, you like to drink lots of water, drink some uh, hemohem, extra vitamin okay. C, and then okay. do some sweating, do some uh, walking or jogging, sweat out the toxins through the Okay. Seat. All right. Thank you so very much, sir. You're welcome. All right, Dr. Suede, that's Stephen Jessup. That's a future Imperial Master, so you remember him. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, Thanks. we got a couple of people raising their hand. I got L. Ped. Dio, help me pronounce your name. I'll tell you, Uncle Mike, I'm Ping. I, I met you from the last class. Thank uh, you, Ping. Ken. Yeah, very good. Uh, Dr. Soy, thank you very much because you're always uh, helpful, especially when it comes to the product. I have a consultation today with one of my co employee So the issue is about her two-thirds of her exophagus is black. And the only question, I already introduced the hemoheme and the probiotic. But sometimes when you go to the doctor, they will give you this, you know, the um, the resiliency of how to start. But the only question I want is, when is the best time for her to start taking either the hemohem or the probiotic with regards to her uh, chemotherapy next week? Oh, chemotherapy. Yeah. She's having, okay. starting first to start next Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The chemotherapy, I recommend that she takes at least six to uh, six to twelve, six to twelve a day. Okay. Yeah. So, in order to protect uh, the good cells you need to have extra because of the chemo and radiation, whatever uh, those invasive uh, treatments can damage your own skin. I mean, the cells, uh, those uh, reproductive cells, okay? Uh, our, most of our cells are reproductive and which means after they, after they die, we produce the fresh cells but uh, the chemo and the radiation can interrupt that process. So, um, you know, the, our hair is a reproductive cell, hair follicles are reproductive, but, uh, you know, uh, because the radiation and chemo can kill all the uh, reproductive cells, so that's why the, uh, the, the, they're losing all the hair. So uh, the chemo him, um, I, I recommended uh, 333 to uh, one of my patients uh, who had uh, the, uh, uh, the, the, uh, the bone cancer after the uh, breast cancer. And uh, she was going through uh, chemo and I recommended the 333 um, and uh, she survived. And uh, she, is, uh, she is cancer free now. And so I, I recommend that you do uh, the mega dose, okay? And uh, for body, of course, and, uh, you know, um, think about, uh, you know, you need to take care of uh, the healthy cells in your body. What would you do, okay? So in the meantime, whatever therapy is killing the cancer cells, but what about the good cells? Um, the, uh, the Western medicine, they are introduced, they introduce uh, the, uh, um, the immunotherapy, um, you know, recently, and it costs a lot, you know, and the uh, immunotherapy is not necessarily better than human. But uh, how much you, you need to take, uh, you know, uh, you need to take omega-dose. 
Okay. okay. Yeah. Um, with regards to your uh, product presentation, I just want, this is just like a, a great testimony. Uh, actually, I just got burned last week and I'm diabetic. So my healing process is too slow. So I tried putting the toothpaste. If, if you really, you can see that in my, in my, the burn in my skin, in two days, it dries up immediately. And I can even like take a bath and everything. So I can attest that uh, toothpaste, Atomy toothpaste is a great product that can also heals the burn in the skin. Uh, it's, a, it's a blister from the boiling oil. But mm -hmm. when I put the toothpaste in two days, it dries up immediately. And mm -hmm. thank you, Dr. Sui. Thank you. Thank very you very good. much Thanks for your time. And caring. Yep. Thank you, Pen. Okay, um, Dr. Sui, we got a question. What do you suggest for skin asthma of a nine-year-old child? Skin asthma. Skin asthma? Yes, yeah, skin asthma. I've, I've never heard of that myself. That's okay, so, uh, you, you know, so when you say asthma, asthma is a lung. The skin is the skin, but in Chinese medicine is connected to your lung. <laughs> so it's the same thing. <laughs> okay, skin asthma, I, I never heard of it, but uh, you know, the, the asthma is actually, uh, is, uh, the, either uh, the uh, allergy reaction from autoimmune condition. Okay, so um, what is autoimmune? The autoimmune is actually we think we're we're attacking ourselves. It's really, it's not really. You know, we are attacking the toxins in our body. Okay, so our good cells. You know, we have our good cells, but that there's so much toxins around good cells. That's why the uh, our our immune cells are uh, are misleading. You know, they think you know our good cells are the foreign cells, our bad cells. It's not actually. It's like uh, they're they're good cells, but they're they're covered with the toxins. So what you need to do is you need to get rid of toxins in your body. That's how I treat uh, asthma actually. And uh, I would recommend that you take like a mega dose for the cancer, cancer patient, like the three, 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 three hemohim, okay? And make sure you take a probiotic. Like I said, you, you have to protect your large intestine to help your lungs and to, to help your uh, asthma and to help your skin. So if anybody's skin is not getting better, don't just look at the skin. You need to look at the lungs. You you need to look at the large intestine. Yeah. So uh, you need to use probiotic. You need to help your immune cells, and uh, you to use hemohim, and also um, uh, and also the red ginseng hong kam dan. Um, the hong kam dan is uh, the, the actually the ginseng is helping the lung more than any other organ. Okay. So if the lungs uh, immunity is low, then you have to use a hong kam dan and uh, along with a uh, hemo him. And uh, some of the people are uh, feeling hot after using a uh, hong kam dan or hemo him, that means the body is reacting. Okay, don't think that's the side effect. There is a difference between, between the side effects and uh, the, uh, the good reaction. Okay, what is a good reaction? Your body heating up because your body is ready to kill all the uh, toxins and the uh, uh, you know, bad bacteria, the virus, viruses, and the funguses, and so on. Okay, so you take uh, both uh, hemohim and uh, red ginseng. Thank you. All right, thank you very much. Okay, we got Karen Pillman. Thank you, um, Dr. Soy. I was wondering on, I have high, high um, blood pressure, heart rate, and heartburn. Are they all co connected? They are one thing. <laughs> You're telling me many things. I, I see, I hear one thing. Okay. It was, I am having trouble with the heartburn. May um, I, may I hear in the public? Yes stress um, you need to work on your mood 
your mood. Your mood is um, angry and anxious. So forgive, including you and others, and tell yourself it's okay. And tell other people it's okay too. Because in your mind, nothing is okay. Right. You need to tell yourself it's okay. You need to calm your mind. There is no medicine can help you other than yourself. Okay. You need to help yourself. You need to, you need to love yourself. You need to hug yourself. You need to tell yourself it's okay. And forgive yourself, forgive your, forgive others. And you can take, and some of the, uh, the atomy products can work for you. Okay. I'm taking how much hemo him and should I take the ginseng? Before you take anything, you need to give thanks. You need to forgive. And you need to appreciate every moment. Everything that you have, everything that you do, you need to appreciate. And when you take anything, you say a prayer. Thank you for, thank for this one. Thank, thank for this, this, yeah. the herb, this product. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Thank yeah. you. Thank you very much, Doctor Sweet. Thank Sweden. you, for, thank you Karen, for for sharing that and allowing him to share it with us all. Because I'm going to tell you something. Uh, we all just learned something right there. So, yeah. so thank you, Karen, so much. All right, thank we're going to go to May Lee Chong. Hi, thank you very much for the time. Dr. Sweet, um, I don't know um, what happened to me when I come on live and I talk uh, a lot and I have, I burp a lot. So I don't really know what happened to myself. If I'm sitting like this, I'm not burping. It's not because after eating and it happened like that. For example, I have been eating for a few hours already, maybe three or four hours before I talked. And um, I start burp. Even, even I took the um, fine sign to help but I still burping, so I don't understand what happened. In the past, I didn't have that issue. Did you drink anything cold? Anything with the ice? Actually, I'm not an ice person. I always drink tea, uh, temperature Did you water. Drink anything cold? Cold, just uh, temperature water. It's not really cold, like icy or anything like that. Okay. Well, it sounds like you have some spasms in your uh, in your stomach, and uh, so make sure you drink something warm and uh, you keep your stomach warm. Okay. Yeah, I think you have the, some spasms, so you need to calm the spasms. So uh, the fine sign or a chemo him or anything like that will not work until your your stomach is calm. So uh, you drink, you can mix half of uh, cold water. You, you pour hot boiled water into cold water and you mix them together, half and half. And you drink that water slowly, try that. That's called yin yang water. That's a miracle. I water. read your, I read yeah. your chart earlier. Um, I was wondering that maybe something happening to my stomach. Uh, I am tea drinkers, and even though when I make tea and I will let you drink it, 
I will add a cold water with no. it. But no, um, you, don't, you don't add the cold water into hot start. water. You add hot water into cold water. Hot water into cold water. Yeah. But when I drink water. them, I. It has to be hot boiled water into cold water. Half and half. Hot water into cold water. Thank you. Drink slowly. If one cup doesn't work, mm -hmm. you drink second cup. Okay? Slowly. Okay? And then after Thank that, you very you can, much. You, you, and, and then after that, you can choose some gum. Try it. Let us know how you do. Thank you. Yes. You say after that, what happened? Let us know how you do. <laughs> drink gum, drink the uh, chewing gum. I don't think that they understood the last part that you said. I was thinking Hans and Dam, but I don't think that's what you said. Some gum. You said chewing gum. Yeah, oh, chewing gum. Chewing gum. Oh, I'm sorry yes. because I didn't hear very well. It's kind of like low volume, no, so I didn't hear very gum. After you, you do uh, hot Indian water and you some you chew some gum. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the information. Thank you. Okay, uh, Martha, and we're going to take uh, we'll take um, there's a call that's in the chat that I'm going to take after Martha, and that will be our last one. Uh, thank you so much. Okay, Martha. Hi, good evening, everyone. Thank you. And God bless you, Dr. Sorry, for sharing um, all your knowledge and your expertise. I, I, I'm so blessed, honestly. Um, well, today my question is, I have a, a co-worker and he has lupus. What would I, um, you know, share with him about, you know, what, what, what should I share with him, you know, that he can take from to me, I know there's things that he can take. Yeah, lupus, as, as you know, is also another autoimmune uh, condition. Okay, so the lupus, um, yeah, our immune cells are attacking some of the, our, our, uh, our own cells, especially in the joint. Uh, depends on uh, where, it, where is the toxin, okay? So, uh, like I shared with you in the, the uh, earlier, uh, you need to normalize all the functions of your system. So, you know, we have many systems in our body. We have a circulatory system, lymphatic system, digestive system, uh, pulmonary system. We have many, many systems, okay? So you need to normalize all those systems. If he has a digestive issues, make sure his digestion is good. Don't talk about <laughs> the diagnosis. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't you're know, not able but... to. You're not able to. You're not licensed to treat disease. Right. You remember? Right. <laughs> so you're yeah. not disease care provider. <laughs> They're not disease care provider. Doctors are. They're licensed. You have to be licensed to, to be the disease care. Okay, you're the right, health care. Right. That means you can only take care of a healthy body. Okay, right. so don't talk about the lupus. The lupus okay, is okay, all, okay. You know, I have a joint pain because of the lupus. I have this uh, redness <laughs> in my cheek. Yeah. I don't all know right. about the lupus. You, you should okay. say, I don't know about the lupus. But I All know right. about a healthy body. You know, you have to have a you have to have a good bowel movement. You know, you need to sleep well. You know, yep. if you have a dry skin, you know, I can help your dry skin. I, I can make <laughs> you feel, you know, not so moody with this uh, aromatherapy. That's that's a health care. Okay. All right. Okay, my dear. All righty. Yeah. So thank you so um, much to share all the good things, uh, all the yep. normal things with your clients. <laughs> all right, my <laughs> dear. You thank feel you. Better and feel all right. Good, okay. As yes, I feel. I you know I just feel bad for him. You know I just yeah. He started to crying, but like you said, yeah, I'm not a doctor. I don't know, but thank you very much for sharing that to me. Yeah. So you can share. 
Chemo him, you can share vitamin C, you can share everything actually. Yep. Yeah, All right. I will. Going to help healthy body because healthy right. body, the percentage wise, is larger than the diseased body. Mm, okay. okay. Yeah, healthy so true. Ignorant of your healthy body. Yeah. Because you're All right. a healthcare provider. <laughs> well, All right. God Thank bless you very, you very much. much. Thank you. Okay, and hey, then the uh, last Mike. Yes. Can you go back oh, about the about the ceiling fan? About the what now? The ceiling the fan? Ceiling. Yeah. Okay. Um oh, ceiling fan. Okay. <laughs> the ceiling fan. You can have a ceiling fan anywhere else except your above your bed. Above your ceiling, uh, the, uh, above your bed, you don't want you don't want to have a ceiling fan above your head while you're sleeping because you don't have the protection while you're sleeping. Your surface, your surface chi, the energy, the surface energy enters in into your body while you're sleeping. So they are protecting your inner organs while you're sleeping. So you don't have the protection outside. That's why you need to have a blanket to cover yourself. Even if it's very hot outside, you still need to cover it, especially your belly. Okay, so that's the ceiling ceiling fan <laughs> ceiling fan syndrome. <laughs> I just made up ceiling ceiling fan syndrome. What you what you're going to feel? You're going to feel achy in the morning. I feel aches everywhere. You remember if you had the ceiling fan above you, that's why. You don't need Tylenol, you're not Tylenol deficient. You're not Advil deficient when you have aches and pain in the morning after you have the ceiling fan on, okay? You don't need Tylenol, you don't need Advil, you don't need anything painkiller because, because you just need to turn off the ceiling fan. You don't need any medicine. All right, thank you very much, uh, Dr. Spray. Thank you for the question, Bubba. Okay, here's the last thing for this evening. Uh, the uh, the person says, I am suffering from cystic acne right now, mostly on my jawline and nose area. Yeah. Is this related to a possible hormonal imbalance? If yes, then what products can I use? I've been taking your probiotic and vitamin C for almost a month now and still having acne. And because her you didn't change your mood. <laughs> you got to change your mood. And she says that my skin type is oily, dehydrated. No, you have a moody. <laughs> it's a mood. Hi, doctor. That's me. <laughs> okay, sorry. Can I share your, your, your acne? It's very, very bad right now. Yeah, and I've been using the, your your agony. Okay, hold on. Let me just go to. No, may I share your agony with uh, with uh, this group? Agony. May, yeah, yeah, it's okay. my acne. Do you want to see my face having acne? No, no I don't have to see it. I know it's it. Okay. <laughs> agony. I don't have to see it to believe it. <laughs> Yeah, I've been using um, different products for, you know, for a couple of months now and nothing has been working. And then I was introduced by your product. So yeah. I'm taking the probiotic and also the vitamin C for, yeah. for like what I said, for almost a month now and still mm -hmm. having the same issue. Yeah. So I, I heard and I was watching your, your, your Sika, is that right? The Sika mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. So I'm not sure. I'm a little bit hesitant of um, using that one because, like I've said, I've been using a lot of products, in expensive, not expensive, but none of them work. So, do you think it is related to hormonal imbalance? Because I thought about um, going to a dermatologist and ask for a medicine, but I'm not sure. Well. I I, uh, I I just uh, gave you the uh, solution. The uh, the cause of your acne um, is because of your mood. 
My mood. <laughs> yeah, your mood. Because your mood has hasn't been changed. You need you, you need to change your mood. So let's start. Well, this is this takes a little long, a little some time. <laughs> so how do you how do you create uh, imbalance of your hormonal system? Because uh, recently my my period is not regular. Why not? Because you're moody. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to define moody, but I don't think I'm moody. I'm not okay, sure. so the moody, the moody, the, the uh, simply to put it is uh, you don't feel good. Mm. So there are there are five five emotions in Chinese medicine: anger, fear, worry, sorrow, and overexcitement. That'll that'll change your mood. So if you're under, let's say if you're under a fear and worry for a long time, then those those uh, emotions can start to change your home. Produce oh. less, produce more. Okay, that'll start to create imbalance. So try not to stay in one one emotions for too long. Whether you're angry, okay. So don't get angry before you go to bed because that'll change your hormonal system. The hormones mm -hmm. are like the sensors in our body. How do you make your hormones down? You um, need to look at your mood. You, okay. you need to look at your emotions. What are the uh, the dominant emotions? that you use every day? Do you use anger every day or do you use fear every day? Or you use combination of anger, frustration, and worry? Not really. I'm just, uh, I'm just frustrated about my acne. That's, that's why I was wondering. Well, then, uh, is, it, is it because uh, of no problem. <laughs> Because whenever I see my face having acne, that changes my mood. I was like, ah, how am I going to treat this? But the anger, I'm not really angry type person. Yeah, um, so, yeah, so this not is really the, sad. Yeah, yeah, so this is the practice, okay? So this is the practice. We need to practice every day. And uh, like I shared uh, earlier, you need to be thankful for everything that you have. Mm -hmm. Whether you're at work or at home or with your loved ones or just with yourself, you need to be thankful and uh, be mm -hmm. mindful. And uh, you don't want to be anxious of anything. And you need to calm your mind mm -hmm. because our mood changes our home. Okay, we we are when we are happy, we produce certain hormones. When we are sad, we produce certain hormones. We when we are angry, we produce more of certain hormones. And when we are it's anxious, we produce more hormones, different hormones. When we are content, we produce different hormones. And we we only know half our hormones. So who knows? There are more or different hormones. And uh, all our there. hormones are managed or uh, regulated by our, by our mood. Mm. So with the uh, cystic acne, uh, yeah, around the uh, uh, chin area is known to be hormonal and uh, related to your uh, cycle, your menstruation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, make sure during the cycle, you need to help yourself and uh, you can try um, the pomegranate, oh, and you can try the uh, milk thistle, and uh, it helps to detoxify your liver because uh, a lot of times before the cycle, uh, the patients or you know the ladies, uh, you get very uh, irritable because uh, the uh, inflammation process is about to start. Okay. 
this whole cycle process is like inflammation. That's why some of the uh, anti-inflammatories can help. But uh, if you want to uh, prevent naturally, you like to be light. You like to let go of many things before <laughs> and during the cycle. Don't think too much because that will change your mood and the mood <laughs> will change your hormones. Okay, and you are going to keep all the toxins in your body, accumulate your toxins, accumulate the toxins in your body. You don't want to keep the toxins. And uh, you can also try um, uh, the, uh, the omega-3 fish oil to improve the circulation. Okay, and uh, okay. use some of the uh, sprays you know, yeah, as you spray the rose, you say, I love you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, I'm allergic to the spray. It's a free. <laughs> say a word, I love you so much. I love myself so much. You know? <laughs> I love, I, I, I appreciate that I can purchase this ro rose mist, you know, so that I feel loved by myself. Okay. okay, thank you very much. Thank you. We are in prayer. You. Yes, we are we are way over time. And so uh uh to Dr. Sway, we just want to say thank you so so much. Let's give him a hand, everyone. And I'm sure we're going to have you back and what and we hope that you'll want to come back. <laughs> right now we're gonna go to Sherry Lee, Sharon Rhodes Master. She's gonna give us the announcements and then we're going to have the closing motto. Sherry Lee, take it away. Thank you so much, Uncle Mai. I want to say thank you to Dr. Sui for the uh, really wonderful uh, presentation. We all learned so much. Thank you so much. Uh, can everyone see my screen? Yes. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, so just a quick reminder, we have uh, some new product in our uh, Atomy uh, Global Mall service. So if you have time, go to your website. This is a few of the new product coming. Uh, if you want to lose some weight, the apple jelly, this is a, we got a lot of good testimony from uh, people in Malaysia, Singapore. This is a great product to uh, to purchase. So go check on your website uh, after the meeting. And this is a two product, uh, Dr. Sui already explained, this two great product for some Summertime. It's a very, uh, it's like a hand size, so you can just carry everywhere. I have been using the uh, the demo, uh, the demo uh, sun stick. I really enjoy this this product. So uh, if you doing the makeup, you can actually use the uh, the the blue one, and you can put over your makeup. So this is a two great new product. Everybody can try. And for the Chinese uh, Zoom meeting uh, next Thursday on the. Uh, our Royal Master, Jason Shim. So we invite a really good speaker, Alex, the Royal Master. So if you have any Chinese partner, please uh, invite them to this meeting. And then if you want, if you don't know the, the Zoom ID, I think they'll post on the Kakao Talk. So you can ask your sponsor. And don't forget to build up your gratitude. This is today, Dr. Sweet keep remind us, uh, build up your gratitude. And you want to be inspired to people. You want someone to look at you uh, in the future, say, because of you, I didn't give up. So always uh, share the good news, share the good love, and I'll be the reason someone smile. When you have a positive uh, energy, your business partner, your friend and family, they want to close to you, and then you will attract more positive people uh, to you. So this is a, a great, uh, great opportunity to share our uh, Atomy product, share the good news to everyone uh, around us. And this is a three product earlier, uh, Dr. Sweet mentioned too. Uh, my favorite one is a cream mist. So that's why I share uh, uh, all my friends and family. I've been finished fifth bottle. Can you believe that? I feel I love this <laughs> so much. So carry this everywhere. And then I also enjoy the rose ring mist. But I have this three product uh, in my uh, in my purse everywhere. But the, my favorite one, favorite, favorite one is the cream mist. So if I haven't tried it, uh, go online your website to order this great product. Actually, I have it here. So every time before and after the meeting, I always spread this cream mist. 
So that's it. Thank you, everyone, to join. Thank you, uh, spend your precious time here with us. And thank you again to Dr. Sui. Uh, back to you, Uncle Mike.